Five times? Yeah, she's crazy. Forty-five times? Yes. She texted me once, uh, one fucking time today, and it was just a few minutes ago, saying, I'm farting. <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm like, what the fuck? She's every That's just time. fucking stupid on her part. No, it's not. She farted 45 times today. Yeah, it is. Because she couldn't fucking send me a text earlier saying something decent. The only fucking text I've got from her is I'm farting. <laughs> well, that's fucking special. Sorry. Hope, didn't, hope she didn't put too much fucking thought into that. Maybe you should have texted her. I did. Fuck, I texted her this morning. I texted her again when I get back from Tony's. Texted her right after she texted, I'm farting. So I said, I want to fuck you. <laughs> she texted back, and that's all she got. And how her fucking exercise and her eating went today, still nothing bad. So I, so I told her, I, I said, uh, uh, I've gotten one text from you today that said I'm farting. Uh, special. I'm sorry. Well, she texted me what she's eaten today, a bowel movement schedule, her activities. She told me about her tattoo crusting over, and she's peeling it off, so it's not even going to be on there anymore. I can already see the ink gone on parts of it. Well, I'm not getting a fucking tattoo until, until she has a good uh, tattoo on there. So just have to wait for it to heal all the way because it could just be the scar tissue from the top layer of the skin that gets shiny and faded. We've got to give it a couple weeks and then we'll see. I told her not to be peeling it. Uh, I'm not getting a tattoo until I see the tattoo that's on there. All right. I don't want, I don't, I don't have anything to say about any tattoos. I think that it was silly for her to get it, but. Well, I don't think it was silly for her to get it. But because I would have gotten one with her name on it, but I'm not going to until I know that my name's on her pussy. Well, Lauren, it's itchy. She's scratching it off. It's not like she's trying to mutilate it off of herself with a knife. Well, until I see it on there, and I ain't getting one until I see it on there. All right, well, I don't care if you get a tattoo on your fucking wiener or not. <laughs> Can't believe she fucking texted you all that information today. She never even said fucking boo to me. All she said, I'm farting. Oh, how, how fucking special. Whatever. Sorry. Thank you for the shirt. How does it fit? I haven't tried it on yet. Oh. It's hot here today. <laughs> Did they get so, my so I've been walking around most of the... Huh? You've been walking around most of the day naked? No, with no shirt on. Yeah. Oh. Oh, oh, you're texting to someone. Yeah. I can hear you. You can hear it? He asked me if he could call me. No, I'm talking to him. Uh -huh. He said he asked me if he could call me. Well, I'm going to let you off the phone so he can call you. I already told him, no, I'm talking to you. 
Well, you don't do that. Why? You're trying to make sure he doesn't, because you, you're trying to make sure that he doesn't go back to his gay friend. But we just got off the phone jacking off with each other. I don't want to talk to him. Oh. I came already. <laughs> you know how we do. Tell him this is a woman's way of teasing. You get him off and then you get off the phone. <laughs> <laughs> you get him off and then you get off the phone. Yeah, that's what I'm That's fucked up texted you that fucking much and she never even said fucking boo to me. Oh, shut up and go try on your shirt. Did they at least put the well, gift message right in there? Yes, she did. <laughs> what did it say? It says, I, uh, I I actually have the lights off in the kitchen and I get a light on in the bedroom and a candle lit in the kitchen. So I get to go in the bedroom and read it. It says, oh, hey, Lauren, summer's coming soon, huh? Better get them, better get the guns ready, Emma. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, Doofy. You you're la- Roscoe, you're like right in the way. Oh, you're he, He's laying right in, literally. Uh, I almost tripped over him. Aw, don't be tripping over Roscoe, yo. He, well, I try not to. He's laying like literally right in the way, but I, I don't want to move him because the fan's there and it's blowing on him and cooling him down and he's black and I uh, gotta make sure he stays cool. <laughs> okay, hang on. I guess I'll put the phone down for a second so I can put the shirt on. Okay. Yay. All right, hang on. Hang on. Yay. But Grandpa Stanley hates pussy. He gets all soft and unhorny. Grandpa Stanley hates pussy. This news. Yep, bitch. Yay. You wearing deodorant? Uh, huh? Are you wearing deodorant? And deodorant. Okay. I actually just put some deodorant on, like, you know, like, deodorant on again an hour ago. Does it get all caked under your hairy armpits, like the little white cakes? Nope. Nope. I make sure it doesn't. You should take a picture of it so I can see I had to take the shirt back off, though, because it's too fucking hot. Huh? You should take a picture of your shirt. Of you in your shirt. No. No, not right now. <laughs> Do it. Come I'll take one tomorrow. I want it now. What's up? Hey, stop trying to stop <laughs> trying to talk sexy to me. I don't like that when you do that. Just take a fucking picture of you in the shirt. I, I'll, no, I'll take you tomorrow. It's too fucking hot right now. It's not supposed to be as hot tomorrow. It's and you'll be able to see me better because it'll be daylight. It's like 11 p.m. Uh, yeah. Are you but it'll sick? be daylight tomorrow. Yeah, but are you getting sick? Am I getting sick? Yeah. Why would it be getting sick? Because it's 11 o'clock at night. How hot can it be outside that you're, it's too hot to have? Well, it, it's just way of, way of when it's, it, uh, Maine is not like California. This is not a dry, hot year. It's a wet hot. It's a wet so hot? So sticky. It, a wet hot. It, it's sticky and humid and uh, it's not like California where you can be, still be comfortable in a shirt when it's 90 degrees out. Maine is humid. So when it's actually, when it's 90, it actually feels like like it's 100. Oh, good and you? I don't know. Yeah, good and you? Like. Yeah, well, you'll find out in August. What, what's up with the, with the parking on the front of the tank top? It's for your cigarettes. I figured that's probably why you put that there. Don't ever do that. <laughs> why? Because that's not a styling. Styling? Are you kidding? When you wear, when you wear a tank top, you don't have a pocket on it to put cigarettes in it. When you have a tank top on it, to show your muscles off and make people think that you actually work out. That's a DC skater brand shirt. That's a what? That's a DC shoes skater brand shirt. It's a high quality brand name. Fashionable garment. I don't know that stuff. Don't buy me expensive stuff. Oh. Do not spend your money on expensive stuff for me. Sixty bucks is not a lot. I'd rather of have money. you. I wouldn't, huh? Sixty bucks is not a lot of money. You better not have spent that much on that fucking shirt. No, you're getting something else on Tuesday. I think. 
you better start. Do not spend uh, spend a lot of money on me. I'm not an expensive guy. I know you. T- well, yeah, you are because you're going to charge me I'm, fifteen grand for your sperm. But Dan gave me the money to buy I, you a present. Remember? I I would rather have you spend money on you or your son. And, and if you're going to buy me anything, go to fucking Walmart and buy me fucking cheap ass tank tops. That fucking you get three for twenty bucks. Something like that. Do not spend a lot of money on me. Would you wear like a Puritan I'm, brand? I'm not. Ex- I'm not expensive. Huh? Would you wear a Puritan brand? What's that? It's I don't know what the hell that is. A Puritan. It's a Walmart brand. Yes. Yeah. Walmart brand. Puritan. That's what I fucking buy. You have. That's Puritans. what I buy. What's a Puritan? I don't know what the fuck a Puritan. I buy Hanes and Fruit of the Loam. <laughs> Lauren, I'm very inexpensive. Lauren. I grew up with fucking hand me down. Those shorts that you sent were Puritans. Well, they probably were. I probably did buy them at Walmart. I don't remember where I bought them. They're a Puritan brand. I was excited to see that. My knowledge of fashion and being a cheap ass really came in handy. Do I even have them anymore? What the shorts? Yeah. Did I send them to you? Not the shorts. I have the hat. Give the hell. What the fuck is the shorts? I don't know where the hell the shorts are at. I know because I took a. Oh, I still had them. You took a picture of them. You said you're going to put them up on eBay, and then I could see the. Yeah, that. Brand. that yeah, that fucking shit. Uh, that shit won't happen again. We want your duffel bag. Didn't realize. No, I mean, anybody gets my fucking duffel bag, it'd be you. Lauren. I've got two of them. Lauren. And I don't, I don't even know where the hell they're at. Lauren. The text me in my boxes somewhere. Lauren. One of my boxes. Huh? Lauren. Lauren. What? Can, can you hear me? Yes. Yeah, can you hear me? Lauren. I'm here. Do you remember? Can you hear me? Yeah, I could hear you the whole time. Do you remember? Okay. A voicemail with me saying, I want those duffel bags. I don't remember it, but From like guess what? Year. You'll get one of them. Yay! <laughs> I don't remember it, but you, you'll get one of them. <laughs> I prank called you. I don't use them. I prank called you while I was having sex with Dan, and we were in bed together, and he said, excuse me, sir, I want the duffel bags on your eBay page. He said, how did you get my number? And he said, it was on your uh, eBay page, sir. Right. And then you said, my number was not on the eBay page. He said, oh, yes, it was. And then we called you back, and you let it go to voicemail, and he said, I want those duffel bags. And then I said, give them to me. Jeez. Like, now, don't you feel good about doing that to me? No, but I feel good about telling you, because it's funny. Well, I feel good about you telling me, you're being, so you're being honest with me. You don't remember that? I don't remember it. I was fucking bidding on your duffel bags, and it wouldn't let me, because it said you took them down already. <laughs> I was going to buy one. Jesus. I was going to use it for a tampon. I, I don't remember it. In my restroom. You were going to use it for a what? A tampon catcher. Like a spittoon for my bloody vagina. Oh, God. Did you really hate me that much? No, I love you. I was just kidding. I'm trying to, I'm trying to make you laugh. You seemed upset earlier. Jesus. Jesus. Fucked up. She texted you all day, and all she sent me is fucking I'm farting. It's so fucking Gee, thanks. It's really I feel really fucking windy. special. Lauren, can you hear uh-huh. me? I'm outside now. Can you hear the wind? No, I can't. Oh, jeez. Really she obviously is. asked you to get, to get you to get my mind off her. But it really is windy, though. <laughs> my allergies are... It's been windy here all day. I'm glad... Dan's not here, because I wouldn't be able to give him a blow. My allergies are fucking acting up today. What? <laughs> <laughs> you can't give somebody a blowjob. I was talking to her with half what she said. You can't give somebody a blowjob with a stuffy nose unless they have a little wiener and there's still room in your in your airway. Oh. You can't give me a blowjob if she got allergies. Well, she has lactose aller- allergies, so... She can give you a blowjob with yeah, her butt. She can't give me. She can't give me a blowjob anyway. She can't fucking even talk to me all day, except for I'm farting. Well, she wants to fart in your face. It's romantic. 
and then you can sing romantic oh, songs yeah. to her. Who am I to blow against the wind? Um, I, are you covering something up for no. so she can talk to someone else? Oh, God damn it, Lauren. I wouldn't fucking do that. I've had a little bit of weed and a few well, glasses of champagne. I'm having fun with you. Don't bring okay. me well, I'm down. Just, I'm, I'm, I'm just making sure because, you know, I, I pay attention to shit. Oh, so that Jesus. I'm not trying to I'm, I make sure it comes out in the open that, that, that I think about things. How many times have I told you shit that I know she didn't want me to tell you? It's stupid to, like... That's well, stupid. I know. I'm not trying to do that, so... No. I know. I'm just being a little bit giddy. Perdóname, señor. My, my, giddy, my giddy best friend. Mike, Mike D? I, uh... Huh? What'd you say? Mike D's my best friend? That'd be cool. Be cool I, I said my friend. giddy best friend. Oh, that's me too. Duh. <laughs> <laughs> I like my penis with coffee and cream. I, um... <laughs> Okay, I I want you to, I want you to listen to this uh, that way you know. Okay. I I talked to Tony Wendy today. Okay. Oh, and I let I let him know that you and Jan are coming out in the first week of August. And um, well, then they're still really really iffy about you because of everything that happened before. Yeah. So. And until they know that you're here in person and, and meeting me in person and and know that you're not going to pull any shit like before on me, they're, they're going to remain skeptical for a while until, until they know for sure. And that's, that's fine. It's, it's, it's understandable. Business. It's understandable because they don't, they don't talk to you and, I don't you know, like they don't know. It's none of my business yeah. what other people well, it, think about me, especially some corn prone people who hardly leave the house because they're too large. I don't give a shit. I know who I am. <laughs> <laughs> no, really, no, come on now. You gotta ease up because they are friends of mine too. I and I do want them. I do want you I do want you two to like each other. I don't wanna And so and you would you you would like, like each other if you're face to face and got to know each other. You would like each other. Los locos well, kick they weren't your talking ass. any shit. Los locos kick your face. Los locos kick your balls into outer space. Remember that from Short Circuit 2? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> <laughs> from what? No, I don't remember that from anything. I... From Short Circuit and That's the two. first time I ever heard that. <laughs> Johnny Five, I'm alive. And Fisher Stevens, and he was... Hey, no, boy. no. Shut up and listen to me. I mean, it's important <laughs> to me that you... That you Give a fuck about Tony. Well, I know. Then that's who I am. <laughs> You're not Mr. Boring. You're Mr. Penis. And it's important to me that you, that you, you and them like each other because they're my friends and you're my best friend. So. <clears throat> texting. Me. Well, of course, she's texting you. She's not texting me. Right, Fucker. He, she said, are you mad at her? Oh, yes, I am. She sent you 45 texts today and couldn't even send me one, with the exception of I'm farting. Well, now there's 48. Huh? Oh, 49. I'm not going to call him if he's mad then. I have not been able to text him. She hasn't been able to text me, but she's been able to text you 40, 49 times. Mm -hmm. Don't make sense out of that. She has her priorities, I guess. Well, her priority obviously isn't me. I wrote good and you on the side of my coffee mug for him. Okay, well, why didn't she write, I love you on her fucking phone and text it to me? Sometime today. Fuck that whiny asshole. I'm not calling him if he's just going to be a little bitch again, crying about every fucking thing. And well, boo-hoo. <laughs> Tell her I love her too. He loves your tubes. That's kind of weird. All right, mom loves you too. Oh, now she's texting me. I'm texting. Hang you. on. Okay. Marita, hang on. 
two pins taken. More logic. I bet you asked that if I was having sex. She's calling me. <laughs> Hang on, I'm texting her back. Hang on. Calling me out from the visitor phone. What is she saying? The call isn't coming through yet. The, the, oh, that, that, um, well, the, the same shit. She thinks that I'm whining and crying and and mad and all upset like crap. Oh. Hang on. What is she saying? The call hasn't come through yet. The, the, oh, that, that, um, oh, the same shit. She thinks that I'm whining and crying and and mad and all upset like crap. Mm. Hang on. Call me in two minutes. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> she thinks I'm all upset, which I am upset that she fucking texted you that many times today and she didn't text me, but, you know, I'm I'm not acting like a prick. And then she thought, she, she, she damn it, hang on, she sent me a couple more messages. <laughs> Lord, Logic. Hashtag. <laughs> and I thought, hashtag.
call me. Oh, hey, 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 she's calling. I got to answer it. Uh, I'll call you right back after I'm done. Hello? 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 Hi, honey. Hi. <laughs> Don't be getting all mad at me and saying that I'm mad and all that. I'm, I'm irritated that you texted Emma 49 times and all I got was I'm farting. Yeah. I knew you'd be pissed. So I'm, I'm, I'm not mad. I'm just wondering why the hell wouldn't you somewhere in this send me something else? Because, because I knew that you were going to cry about it, number one. And I knew oh, that she was going to tell you. So you want to hear me cry? Yeah. <laughs> oh, why? Do you like it when I cry? Yes. I'll, so you do that to irritate me so that I'll bitch. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, you're so fucking funny. I know. <laughs> <laughs> you, know what, you, you know what's sad, though, is that I don't bitch like I used to. You don't? You're a changed man? No. I, I trust you. Good. Good, good. So, so what are you gonna, now? What are you gonna do though? What do you mean? Because it's not gonna irritate me as much when you do that. No, it'll irritate you. I have well, to yeah, it myself. Will. <laughs> it, it will. It will because I know because I love hearing from you and I love reading your text and right. So yeah, it will irritate me. Yeah, I know. So I'll keep. So doing you just it. want to do it just just to hear me bitch. Yes, it's my favorite. Uh, you, you're so clever. <laughs> I know. <laughs> so. I love you. So when are you going to take off your pants? Are they already off? Are they already off? I'm fucking walking around naked. How many pants do you want me to take off? I don't know. Are you walking around with a condom on too, or do you have to put that on? With a condom on? I don't have a condom on. Let's talk business. Huh? I said, let's talk business. You want to get me fired. You want to fuck me, don't you? Yeah. Go get a condom and jerk off into it. Wouldn't you rather have me jerk off into a condom and be able to send you a picture tomorrow morning? You say you can't do it tomorrow morning, too? Are you telling well, me that I you're can't. so fucking old and dried up that you can't do it now and you can't do it later? <laughs> well, I can you're an old ass motherfucker. Yeah, but you still want to suck my cough. And I'm not fucking old. What the fuck are you talking about? Oh, yes, you are. Oh, my ass. You're ass. Oh, my ass. Everything on you is old. Oh, really? Does everything on me look old? Yeah. Even my cough, huh? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Because <laughs> I yeah. love my cough. Got kind of like a. A weird kink to it. It's almost like it's broken. What? What? Your cock is it kind of has a kink to it, so it kind of shoots off to the side. Well, maybe it's you better suck like, it straight. It's almost like a dying baby bird. Hang on one maybe second. Maybe you should suck it straight. Hang on. Come on, you you're rushing me. I'm old, remember? You gotta give me time. <laughs> Yeah, I know. It takes a lot uh, of time. Yeah. <laughs> so what are you wearing? You, you can't fucking do anything because you're on the restricted number. Yeah. Yeah. So, so how many people are around you? I don't know. There's nobody right here right now. There's nobody around nobody you. There, right? yeah. So fucking get but to it. But you can't do anything. So... So, are all of them, do you have your girlfriends around you and they're being quiet so they can hear me? Nobody <laughs> wants to hear you. <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah. So, why are you calling from the rec phone instead? Because I want to save my other phone. Well, well, I guess that's a good reason. Right. So, but there are only girls around you when they walk in, right? Yes. 
Can see, we just do this so you, or what? You, so you can do something. No, I'm not doing anything. I don't want to catch oh, another so charge just, for indecent exposure. Oh, well, yeah, that's true. Smart ass. All right. Turn me on, girl. Go. I'm going. You don't need me to help you. Just fucking do it. Be a man for once. Oh, really? Hurry up and come, you freak. Come on. <laughs> you know, that don't help. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you know, it would help us if you were here with me. Okay, but I'm not. Yeah, well, hurry the fuck up. I'm getting bored. Well, gee, I'm fucking sorry. You should be. Well, so I'm getting fucking bored. We'll do something about it then. Well, you shouldn't have called me the fucking right phone. Did you want me to not call at all? You can, you can huh? Call so you can cry phone. about that again? No, you know, me, I'm sensitive. <laughs> well, yell at me, why don't you? Uh, yeah, yell at me, why don't you? Exactly. <laughs> hey, what are you wearing today? I'm wearing little booty shorts and a like a little t-shirt. Oh. Okay. Will you stop rushing? It doesn't work like that when you're fucking rushing me. It's not like I can come in two minutes. I'm trying to fuck you. Okay. How many minutes is it going to take? However, it What do you think I can do it at command? You should be able to. Like, you're supposed to be this horny young man, and you're pretty much just an old, shriveled up pud with a little shrinky dink. So, why do you want me? I don't know. Well, come on, be honest now. Hang on a second. <laughs> okay. Did you tell your friends to shoot? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hmm. So I've seen your pictures. You saw my pictures? Yeah. I can't, I can't do this right now. I can't fucking talk to you. I think it's hard, but I'm so fucking close, you know, what uh, you did today and fucking all about you. Oh, okay. And I, I really need to hear your voice when I do it. You in the action, too. Yeah. But yes, I can't. About today. Lauren. I know. We can Come talk. On. Come on, honey. But I just... Give me something to think about later. Uh, well, how many fucking pictures of me do you have? I don't know. A lot. Okay, so it's not something... That, that, there's not something there that you can think about? No, I want to hear your words. I want to hear all the well, nasty stuff that you want to say to me. Well, when we're able to do it together again, <sighs> that'll happen. Okay. I have a difficult time not being, not hearing you, and you, you fucking thrashing out words to me that are like, have nothing to do with what I'm doing. You stop. And me not being able to makes it even harder. But I want to know about what you did today. I'm, I'm interested in you for more than just sex, you know. Yeah. Um, I, I know you never had that having, before, but. I did a lot of rehabilitation. Okay. What about okay. your exercise? Okay. Just go. I'm going. Huh? <sighs> yeah, and then you get a fucking charge. Ain't that cute? And then you won't be able to come out here. Yeah. 
Children, I'm your mommy. Yeah, oh. Mommy of my children. No. <sighs> you want to be my grandson? Oh. <sighs> my bad grandson. Play with my grandma titties. <sighs> oh, yeah. <sighs> 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 Pretend I'm your niece. Uh, yes. Oh, uh, you're my bad uncle. Uh, you're fucking me. Uh, yeah. Uh, oh, you're coming for your niece. Uh, oh, so hot. Uh, oh, pretend we're uh, watching. Oh, yeah. Uh, Fuck my little niece, uh, pussy. Oh. Yeah. Oh, you love that. Mm. Mm. I knew that would get you. disturbing at all. Uh, I, all I was hearing was your voice. That turned me on. <laughs> yeah, that I was your niece. Naughty, uh, naughty uncle. I didn't know what you said. saying. All I heard was your voice. I didn't know what you were saying. Bullshit. Bullshit. I didn't. I never even grew what you were saying. Oh, yeah. I just heard your voice. <laughs> no, no, that's such a lie. Yeah. You can't. So what did you say anyway? <laughs> that I was your uh, niece. You uh, said you were my niece? Yeah, and then you dropped I your thought, load. I thought you said you were on your knees. <laughs> no. 
No. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> we went through a lot of scenarios fuck? that I was your grandma and I was your mommy. And then when you became my uncle and you were fucking me like your naughty niece, that's when you dropped it. You loved it. Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus oh, Christ my isn't going to help you. <sighs> yeah, whatever. You are fucking freaky. Christ. You are freaky as fuck. Yeah, no. It helps when I know what you're saying. All I heard was your voice. <laughs> uh, Just admit that you knew what I was saying. Huh? You knew what, you knew what I was saying. That's so stupid. I, no, I didn't know what you were saying. I just listened to your voice. I, I thought you said you were on your knees, and that that's... Mm, that's pretty much all the rest of it. I just heard what you were about your fucking voice, so I didn't know exactly <laughs> what you were saying. <laughs> Did you come uh, all over your fat ass with a belly? <laughs> no. I kept no. spelling your name. <laughs> I kept spelling your name. <laughs> no, I saw that cum load, and it's really not that big. You're not spelling shit. <laughs> Yeah, well, you didn't see underneath. I didn't see underneath. Yeah, you didn't see underneath because un yeah, okay. underneath is where you know and gravity <laughs> takes over. Like gravity took over gravity. your belly. This time, no, took over on the counter. Well, actually, on the cabinet. <laughs> That's disgusting. But <laughs> oh. <laughs> Does it taste good? Oh, fucking... Come on. I don't know. I didn't taste it. Come on. It's fucking harder than hell in here. I don't wear that. Okay, we're going to go for round two. You ready? No. What do you mean, no? I need a fucking break. I'm, I need a fucking break. I'm old, remember? <laughs> yeah. Now, see, I could, eat, I could eat you right now. If you were here, it might be a different story. I might be ready for round two. So why don't you put the phone up to your ass and slap it? Why? Because I want to hear you slap mm -hmm. your ass. Okay, and, and your friends are not there listening to me, right? No. I told you nobody wants to hear this. Oh, yeah, but still. <laughs> All right, you ready? Yeah. There you go. Did you get through a lot of that one? Do it one more time. Oh, no. Why? Because I wanted you to actually slap it. I didn't want you to tap it. Don't be a fucking baby. Slap your ass. No, you mean... mean what you mean to tell me is your friends are listening to what? Nobody gives a shit about I you do. slapping your ass or coming. Trust me. Just do it. I give a shit. You're such a fucking baby. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Don't you love me for it? No. Pisses me off. Oh, you don't love me? You don't love me? God, you're such a baby. <laughs> I know. <laughs> you get your baby ways and I got mine. You're ruining it for me. No, I'm not ruining it. Don't, don't even say that. Oh, you are, though. I'm being honest. Oh, well. <laughs> I've been looking forward to it things. all day, and here comes Lauren like a fucking brick. I was looking forward to hearing something from you all day, and the first thing I got was I'm farting. Yeah. Okay, so let's not ruin this by fucking saying how bad of a guy I am, because I won't slap your ass so your friends can hear it. My, f like I told you, like I told you, nobody gives a shit about hearing you, except for me. So don't get all fucking paranoid like your hashtag Lorne Logic. Well, you got your hashtag logic too. I know. No, there's only there's only hashtag Lorn logic. You hear that? Yeah. So I can hear somebody's back and something in the background. Mm-hmm. That was me. Huh? That was me. That was you? Yes. Well, did you hear me? No. Did you hear that? Yeah, I heard you shut your britches. I don't shut my britches. That's such a redneck thing <laughs> to say. 
I'm going to have to teach you not to be a redneck. <laughs> Just because you live in a dirty trailer doesn't mean you have to talk like you do. Did you hear that one? Do it just a little bit you harder. fucking better have heard that one because my fucking ass hurts now. <laughs> Do it again. You deserve it. Oh, my fucking... I have a cheek. Hear it? Yeah. All right. Good. Now you fucking walk a little bit because my ass is fucking stinging. Okay. Do it like three times in a row. Just go back. Yeah, right. Like fucking no way. Ugh. My fucking ass is burning. My hand is a lot rougher than yours. Did you, aren't you supposed to have I lotion? Use, I use lotion. Well, what I the use fuck, lotion man? on my hands. You're not putting your hands on me. That's for sure. I work. I work. Did you ever hear I of work. gloves? Uh, yeah, there's gloves, but, you know, gloves don't always work that well. Does your butt feel better? It kind of burns a little bit, but it's the hole. It's not the cheek. It's what? It's the hole that is burning a little bit, not the cheeks. Well, I'd like to, I'd like to stick my cock in the hole. Right. But you're not putting right. your crusty-ass hands on me, that's for sure. You better get that straightened but out. My crusty-ass hands are going to be all over you. No, they're not. I don't have crusty-ass hands, thank you very much. Yes, you do. No, I don't. Yeah, you do. You just said that you have rough hands. How crusty and scabbed. Um, no, my hands are not crusty. My hands are smooth. It's just that they're... No, you said they're rough. Muscular. No, I said they're rough and they're, they're muscular. That's not what you said. Why do you I get don't have tape crusty tape hands. It's because you had crusty hands. It was your thumb. Uh, are you believe what you want. That's what you said. That's why you got your dick all shaved up. Remember? Well, before, but I use lotion all the time. Oh. I put lotion on my face in the morning. I put it on my neck. I put it on my hands. I use lotion because I don't like having crusty hands. But oh. still, I can't help that that I use my thumb because I I actually work. I do stuff. Right. I can't not do stuff. Mm -hmm. If I not do stuff, then I get bored. I can tell by those pictures that the stuff that you're doing is eating. Fat ass. <laughs> uh, yeah, and what did you do for exercises today? I ran. I did yoga. I did like 250 crunches. What did you do besides you nothing? Do? I did a lot today. I moved a lot of crap today. Yeah, but you didn't work out. You did poor people. I didn't work. have to work out. Well, the, the, the amount that I sweat today, I didn't have to work out because I was doing enough by just sweating. It was yeah, hot you here. You took a shower. What's that? Yeah, I know. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> That's exactly what I was expecting. Obviously, I took a shower because I sent you a picture of them asking you if you wanted to get clean with me. Did you not see that message? <laughs> It was attached to the, to the same message that I sent the picture in. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Rotten <laughs> bastard eat this time. <laughs> Fat fucker. Yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah. Uh, You're all greasy. But see, I, I, get a, I get a lot of lot of food that I eat all the time. Constantly. I'm constantly yeah, I'm sure. eating fruit. They don't have fruit at McDonald's. Just, uh, no, not at McDonald's at all. That, that's just because I was lazy and didn't feel like making breakfast. Who's that voice that I heard? There's nothing. There's nothing. Mm -hmm. like it's probably a mini syllable that you were doing. It's all like guy's voice in the background. There's nobody here, Lorne. Okay, well, I'm just, just saying maybe, might have, maybe it was my voice. Telling you that I heard one. Okay. I, well, anyway, I've got, I've got cantaloupe, I've got honeydew, I've got pineapple, I've got oranges, I've got bananas, I've got some type of fruit that I don't even know what the hell it is. So get, probably mango. I got a no, don't hit it. It's, it's well, I don't know. It might be, but if it is, a small one. I saw your fruit juice video, and I think it was a mango. You're like, I don't know what this is. 
Somebody just gave it to me. <laughs> wow, there's a lot of food that I haven't seen before. I didn't realize they made food that I hadn't seen before. I know, because they don't have it at McDonald's. Uh, that's right. I don't usually go to McDonald's. Usually I go to Burger King. That's for a barbecue bill for bacon double cheeseburger with barbecue sauce. That's disgusting. No pickles. Oh, it's fucking awesome. No. You need to cut that it shit out. It is awesome. I'm serious. Yeah, but that's flame broil, so a lot I of the grease I told you that you need to lose that. weight. You need to lose a lot of weight. Right. I'm not fucking around. No more, no more Burger King, no more McDonald's. No more Burger King, McDonald's, pizza, bread. You need to lose at least 10 pounds this week. I can't lose 10 pounds in a week. I don't have 10 pounds a week to lose. Oh, yes, you do. You have more than that. The, the only way I would be able to do that is to work for a mace as a laborer. No, you can work I out. Go for of, a run. How about if you take your dogs for a walk? I did that when I was 19. I lost a lot of my weight. That? Take your dogs for a walk. So in other words, you want me to quit smoking? What? So in other words, you want me to quit smoking? I can't fucking run if I smoke. Why would you be smoking while you're running? <laughs> I, I smoke not while I'm running, but I wouldn't be able to run very far if I smoke. Okay, then quit smoking. It's disgusting anyway. You, you, you haven't smoked as long as I have. So, <laughs> you, you literally just started smoking, so it's very easy for you to quit, which I really want you to do. No. Because if you do it, then it's going to encourage me to be able to do it. You can be stronger than that, can't you? Yeah, but it's tough. I've yeah. smoked. smoked since I was 20 years old, with the exception of a couple of years. And it's still a tough thing to do. Yeah. So fucking do well, it. Encouragement, help. encouragement helps. Don't be a pussy. You quit. No, you, you know, quit. encourage me to quit. No. Because if I, if I quit, you're going to have to quit anyway. I don't have to do shit. What are you saying? <laughs> uh, don't be all cocky and shit on me, girl. Or what? If you quit, it's going to encourage me to quit. It's going to help me quit. I heard that if you run and smoke at the same time, it'll make your cock straight. Uh, my cock ain't getting <laughs> straighter than what it is. <laughs> <laughs> that sucks. It's like a 90 degree yeah. angle. Yeah. Oh, you don't like my cock? It's like a 90 degree angle. <laughs> you don't like my cock? I, it's cute. Huh? I said it's cute. It's cute? Yeah. <laughs> it's almost like it got stuck so in a you, door. <laughs> so, you, so you like my cock, though? Don't be desperate for compliments. Uh, no. Nope. I just want to hear compliments from you. Well, don't be desperate about them because I'm not going to give them. Yeah, well, things work a lot better when you do give them. No. Yeah. Not yeah, for me. Don't. don't be desperate for compliments. That's really sad. Uh, it, it just it just helps me to know that you love me. And it makes me want to do things more for you. So I have to compliment you for you to do things for me? Please. No, it, it just makes me want to do more things for you. <laughs> make you happy. Well, See, shouldn't I, you, I know shouldn't what you, you want grew me. up with. Shouldn't you want me I know me what you grew up with, you but now you're mouth. not with shut that. Shut up. Shut the fuck up, you uh, little you shut fucking the fuck up and listen small to me. <laughs> dick motherfucker. Shut up. All right, shut up. And, all right, go ahead. I'll shut up so you can fucking talk. So you're not going to let me talk. Go ahead. Okay. The thing about a compliment, the nice thing about a compliment, you're still talking. Okay. Oh, I'm sorry, honey. <laughs> okay, the go nice ahead. The nice thing about a compliment is that they're supposed to just come out of the blue. You're not supposed to ask for them. That's sad and pathetic. Do people ever just give you compliments out of the blue or do you always have to ask for them? Nope, people give me compliments out of the blue all the time. Like what? But the difference is, it's somebody that I want to hear the compliments from is what means the most to me. 
Yeah, but you can't ask for them. That's so no, lame I'm and you stupid. Don't give me hints. I'm giving you a, I'm giving you a hint because I know what you grew up with, and what you grew up with is completely different than what I grew up with. Right. Okay, does that make any sense to you? No, it doesn't make any sense. None. What I grew up with and what you grew up with has nothing to do with me wanting to give you a compliment. If I feel like doing that, then I will. If you act like a little fucking bitch, then I'm not going to say shit because I know exactly what you're doing and that makes me not do it. But then you have to think about how your train of thinking is. Is your train of thinking right when it comes to me or is 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 it not right when it comes to me? Because I'm not getting my you. Train of, I have to do the same thing too. My training, you, my train of thinking is not right when it comes to you because you tell me different things. So I do whatever makes you happy. Do what makes you happy, and then if it makes me happy, then it's all good. What makes me happy is making you happy. That's what makes me happy. Wow. If you're not happy, then obviously I'm doing something wrong. That's why I like hints from you. So that way I know exactly where you, which way you want the road to go so you'll be happy. Okay, there's a difference. If I don't by, make you happy, I'm not doing my job. Right. There's a difference by letting someone know about you and they can pick up certain clues about what you like and things like that. But when you say, do you love me? Do you love me? Tell me you love me. Do you like my cock? That, I mean, that's desperate. <laughs> that's complete oh, and total I'm, desperation. I'm, uh, I am better off just to fucking say nothing and shut my mouth and let you do what you want, in other words. Right, right. Hashtag Lorn Logic. That's what we're talking about. <laughs> Come on, say it with me. Hashtag Lorn right, Logic. Hashtag Lorn Logic. I'm better off, again, just shut my mouth. Exactly. Do you do this to Emma? Huh? Do you do this to Emma? Do you talk to her the same way? Do you beg her to tell you how great Emma- you are? Emma is not my woman. No, but still, Emma, do you... Emma's my friend, not my woman. I understand that, but... No, I don't do the, No, I don't do the stuff to Emma. Okay, then treat me the same it's, way. It's not, treat you the same way? Yeah, you, treat me like a person. You and I are completely different than what me and Emma are. Treat me like a person. Don't beg me. That's so sad. And quite frankly... I, I treat you... It makes I me laugh. I treat you like a person. It, I laugh at you. Doesn't I don't like that you laugh at me. That doesn't well, I do. make me laugh. Well, and what fucking sucks is I gotta keep my smart ass remarks to myself. What do you mean? What smart ass remarks? Any smart ass remarks that I come up with, like I have what? to keep them to myself. Anything I come up with. Like what? Doesn't matter. Anything I come up with, I have to keep it to myself. So otherwise, yeah. you get offended, and then you fucking then you lash out at me. I don't lash out at you. I'm perfectly reasonable. The only thing I know is that I love you and all I care about is making you happy. Okay, so, if you want to make me happy... But I also want you to know, I also want you to know, I'm not going to completely let go of the person that I am. So there's some things that you're going to have to let go of yourself. Are you still talking or are you done? Oh, I'm done. Oh, okay. Um, Compromise is a bitch. You're a bitch. Now, I want you to sing. <laughs> Did you just call me a bitch? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I love you. Oh, that's funny shit. <laughs> yep. Oh, uh, yeah, but I'm your bitch, though. Mm-hmm. Just be, just be careful of how much, of a, how much you treat me like a bitch. Uh-huh, you like it. Uh, no, I love you, and that's the only reason I bow down to some of the crap that you hand me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, sing to me. Huh? I said, okay, sing to me. Sing like, um, Thank you. I don't know. No, I said, sing to me. Sing like, oh. I'm a little teapot. Do you know that one? I don't know a little teapot. A little teapot short and show you fucking... You saw a fucking mouse and you ran the fuck out. <laughs> How's that? That's oh, horrible. You're wrong, okay. Dad. <laughs> I'm listening to you, country song. Oh, I fucking hate those songs. 
So boring. I know it. I know it. So boring. <laughs> then don't sing it then. <laughs> yeah, it compromise stock, doesn't it? <laughs> no, I'm telling you, I hate, I fucking hate country music. Look into my eyes, you will see what you mean to me. Search your heart, search your soul. Mm -hmm. When you find me there, you'll search no more. Don't tell me it's not worth trying for. You can't tell me it's not worth dying for. You know it's true. Everything I do, I do it for you. Look into my heart, you will find There's nothing left to hide. Take me as I am, take my life, I will give it all, I would sacrifice, don't tell me it's not worth dying for, I can't help it, there's nothing I want more. No, it's true. Everything I do, I do it for you. There's no love like your love, and no other could be more love. There's no way unless you're there all the time, all the way. Yeah. Can't hit that note on me <laughs> right now. You know it's true. Everything I do, I do it for you. I know that's your song is a little short. You want, you want to do more? Uh, yes. Want another song? Yeah. Okay, hang on. <clears throat> Baby, you're all that I want. When you're lying here in my arms, I'm finding it hard to believe we're in heaven. Loving is all that I need. And I find that there in your heart, it isn't too hard to see we're in heaven. Oh, once in your life you find someone who will turn your world around, bring you up when you're feeling down. Yeah, nothing can change what you mean to me. Oh, there's lots that I can say to just hold me now. The love will lie the way. And baby, you're all that I want. When you're lying here in my arms, I'm finding it hard to believe mm. we're in heaven. Mm. Loving is all that I need. And I find it there in your heart. It isn't too hard to believe we're in heaven. Heaven! Whoa! Okay, you get some high notes on me. <laughs> mm, yeah. Let me hear you. <laughs> I want to fuck you right now. Oh God, why can't you hear me here with me? Oh, 
I'm trying to think of another song for you, so you, so you can go until you, until you come. Mm. God, I fucking want you here with me. <laughs> Oh, let me think of another song. <laughs> trying to think of that. Trying to think of that Glenn Madero song. Hang on, baby, I'm coming. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, baby. Beat that pussy. That's that's my girl. Beat that pussy. My cock slamming into it. Oh yeah. Oh. Yes, I mean, it's, oh my god, that should be my fucking cock. That should be my cock fucking slamming into you right now. Mm. That should be my cock fucking banging so hard against your pussy. Mm. Oh, yeah. Oh, god, I want to fuck you so hard. Mm. Oh, come on, bitch. Come, come for me, baby. Come for me. <laughs> Think of all my balls smacking up against you. Mm. Think of all my curved dick inside of you. My thick curved dick. Thing inside of you. Think of all my balls and them. Smacking up against your pussy. I was doing all kinds of sounds. Uh-huh. I was doing all kinds of sounds. Oh, I know, but I feel like at the same time I heard slurpers all the way. Jesus Christ, fucking slurping. I was pretending like Emma was here, too. So I was slurping on her. I wish you were here with me. <laughs> yeah. And I could slurp you. Right. You'll first week first of week August, August, we're going to have a threesome with Emma. Uh, no, we're not, because Dan's going to be here, and Dan and Emma are going to be with Dan and Emma, and you and me are going to be with you and me. And Emma, too. I'm going to disrespect Dan like that. And no, we're not going to be there. No, no, Jesus Christ, don't you want just me yet? Yeah, but I love it when Emma's there, too. Well, if Dan and Emma don't work out, then then me and you will do a threesome with, with them all. Oh, so now we have to wait for Dan to be out of the picture? Come on. 
Uh, All we have to do is throw a little twinkie ass in front of him, and he'll just he'll go for that. (laughs) Yeah, well, I don't want you walking your ass in front of him. No, twinkie ass. You know what a twink is? Yeah, well, a a twink, a flock, a a fucking twitch. I don't want you doing that from the damn. No, do you know what a twink is? (laughs) You obviously don't. I know what a twinkie is. No, a twink is a gay man, a, like a gay boy, you know, really yeah, well, I, uh, I'm not twinking my ass for any guy. No, you are definitely not a twink. No, <laughs> amen to that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want you twinking your ass for him either. Okay, you still don't know what it is, okay. Well, I know a, a, a gay guy... Twinking his ass for another guy. No, no. A twink is a good-looking gay guy, like a really good-looking young gay guy. Super. Oh, like, so we gotta find. Shame. We gotta find Dan. We gotta find Dan a gay guy to, to <laughs> spend the night with. Well, I mean, you have fucking threesome with Emma. Yeah. Have you Come on him? now. That's not gonna happen. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> give it time. Uh, me and you need to spend time with me and you first. Well, yeah, I know. We're and gonna let get Dan to that, and Emma but... have their own time. Yeah, I know. And we'll then, get to that. yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, we'll blah, get blah, to blah, that. Blah. Yeah, we'll get to that. Yeah, we'll get to that. Let's go straight on me and you first. Well, they're going to be there too. Uh, yeah, but they'll be in a different room. Can we still well, listen let's in? Me and you Can first. we hear them? Let's, let's get to me and you first. We'll get to a threesome with Emma when it comes time. Don't, don't I don't want to freak Dan up for Emma because she really does love them. Of course she does. So when it when it comes time, Emma will still have a threesome with me and you. It's, yeah, just, okay. it's just she won't she won't be able to tell Dan. What? We're not going to have them lie. Huh? We're not going to have them lie. That would be horrible. Well, no, but you know, we all we also can't help what happens with her and Dan. We can't slow her and Dan from falling in love with each other and wanting to be together. That's not going to having a threesome isn't going to do that. Baby, you can't force somebody into having a threesome. No, she can't help the way she feels no, about she Dan. Can, he can be there too. And then when you can come, you that can would, put it in Dan's butt. That would be a foursome. Right. We can have a foursome. You know how I feel about guys even seeing me naked. Oh, you've done it before. You like it. No, I don't like it. Yes, you do. No, I don't. It's just a guy. No, I don't. It's yeah, just another it's guy. It's just a guy, but that doesn't mean that I like it. He'll jerk you off. You like no. that. No. No guy will touch my dick, period. And no guy ever will touch my dick. So what's this about your tattoo coming off? What about it? Do you Does Emma tell you everything? Like, what the fuck? Oh, well, yeah. Yeah, she's my best friend and she's your best friend. So? Uh, I never said so? she was my best friend. You said that. Um, yeah, but you know she is. It's kind of obvious. What do you mean it's obvious? It's obvious, because you can find her just as much as I do. You guys just talk about me. You two just talk about me. I talk about what's, what's going on with me to her, and then she goes and tells you. That's why I knew if I didn't text you today, you were going to cry about it. But if I text her, she's going to tell you that I've been texting her all day. Here comes Lauren, fucking out blazing. <laughs> Yeah, but you should have fucking texted me anyway. No. That shit, that shit you should have told me anyway. What do you mean? Tell you what? Why wouldn't you, why wouldn't you want to tell me that stuff? What, that my tattoo is uh, all crusty and disgusting? It got all infected? Maybe I don't want to tell you. I don't have to tell you everything. Well, I mean, it's kind of something, stuff that I would like to know because it, it involves you. No, I think of, you're just annoyed you know, that you're not getting attention, and then you act like a little no, sissy Mary bitch. No, it, it's closeness that I want to share with you that you're not sharing with me. 
You're sharing it's it with them. It's a crusty Emma. tattoo. It's a crusty tattoo. She knows about tattoos. She has spiders all over her. She's uh, I a know. spider whore. I know. I hate fucking spiders. <laughs> yeah, she has tattoos. I know. She, so she, she knows about of, it. She sent me some pictures of some of her fucking tattoos. She said, and I told her, I told her I was I said, I hate fucking spiders. I, I think they're fucking gross. She's known about it for a long time. They're not spiders almost ever since I first met her. Right. Staying spiders, they're disgusting. What about the roaches that are probably crawling around your floor? They're not crawling around my floor. <laughs> you just can't oh, see I them. don't like roaches either. <laughs> I don't like bugs. They're fucking gross. I bet you they love your trailer, though. They don't love my trailer. They wind up dead. What do you mean you, you get to crawl all around my fucking trailer? You know they you are. Must think, you must think that I really live in a fucking slum place, huh? Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Uh, well, the, the place I live in isn't the greatest in the world, obviously. But the, the, the difference is, is that I can do something to fix it. Because so I have the knowledge of how to fix those I am. But I also have other things that take priority over me fixing this place. Like but I'm, I'm fixing it and taking care of that other shit at the same time. <laughs> 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 oh, Jesus. I love you. <laughs> I didn't know that was coming. I love you. <laughs> <laughs> All righty then. <laughs> <laughs> Man, it stinks so bad in here. Oh my god. Gee, gee I wonder why. Maybe the air conditioner has a has a faulty valve. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, something like that. Jesus <laughs> uh, <geez is> Christ. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, Goddamn assholes can't even take care of their air conditioning. <laughs> What the fuck is wrong with that place? Oh, oh God. <laughs> yeah, clearly I don't care how you jerked I, off. I don't. Your I do not care. Saying that I do not me. care how anybody feels about putting glitter on my dick, dick or whatever. Constantly. Don't you care about that? If you don't like me not putting glitter on my dick, then you're not going to want anything to do I with me. I just asked you, you fucking little baby ass bitch. You're such I know. a bitch. That will go through I what I went through. I just you a fucking question. God, you're so fucking Go through stupid. what I went through and then you might fucking understand a little bit. No, I would never go through with what you're going through, ever. Yeah, well. Because I'm not a dumb fucking start, bitch. Start, start, understanding, start understanding what I fucking went through. No. And you'll understand How why, understand why I'll it? do certain so things stupid. and why I won't do certain things. All you had you to understand? do was say no. All you had to do was say no. Instead, you go on this little baby ass bitch rant about how yeah, oh, you have to understand you can, how I feel. You, can, you continuously fucking say that, oh, that I'm a bitch just because I don't do a certain bitch. fucking thing. Well, because yeah, you're acting like a bitch. That's why I'm calling you one. I'm, I'm acting like a bitch. Yeah. Well, uh, let me give you an update. Ramona asked me to do fucking certain things. Other people have asked me to ask me to do fucking certain things. And I did them. <laughs> Wound up looking like a fucking asshole. Like a fucking moron. Okay. So what does that until have to do with we're face me? To face, until we're face to face, there are certain things I'm not going to fucking do. I've, okay. I've, done more for you, I've done more for you than what I would ever have done for anyone else. Okay, so how about if you calm your ass down? I'm, I'm calming down. I, I need you to understand this, some of this weird ass shit that you asked me to do. It's not so easy for me to do. Okay, so then don't do it. I don't fucking care. I was just asking. Okay, and I don't. I don't need you to be mad at me because of it. Lauren, I really don't care that much. I was just asking you a question. Okay, I thought that it was funny. I apologize. Well, it will be funny, and after we meet, after we meet, it will be funny. They don't have no problem at all doing anything for you. You're so sensitive. I am, because look at look at my fucking name on the internet. <laughs> you see that shit on there? The shit affects me. I don't want people thinking about me like that. They already do, Lorne. 
they already do, and the only one that can turn it around is me. Yeah, so turn it around. I'm not posting shit on the internet. What the fuck? I know you're not. I know you're not. You're acting like I a can, little metrosexual. I completely, no, I completely trust you. But the, the problem is, is I hate it when you ask me to do weird ass shit because I feel really uncomfortable with it until you and I are face to face. Okay, so I get to see the same dick pics every day. Here it is, huh? pointing a little bit to the left. Here it is, pointing a well, little bit to the right. I'm doing it at a different angle. Well, at least, at least you get to see it. I don't get to see you. When we're face to face, you'll get to see it. How about that? Okay, well, when we're face to face, you get to see my dick again because you keep complaining about seeing them. Same old pictures. Time yeah, after, it looks time the time. same. Yeah, well, at least you get to see me every day. I was hoping that it was going to start looking bigger, but it's not. Because well, clearly you're still a fat ass. That big floppy belly well, still hiding in there. Sorry, I'm a disappointment to you. Oh, it's okay. I don't know why you want me if you... I don't know. know why I you know. want me if I'm a disappointment. I know, it's okay. It's okay that I'm a disappointment? Yeah. Yeah, sounds good. So here you are doing the opposite of when you beg for compliments. You put something out there that's negative. You want me to say, no, Lauren, that's not what I mean. What do you want me to say? That, that I love it when you fucking put me down? I don't. You should kind of like that's it. How we, that's how we grew up different. You love it when you get put down. I don't, I don't love it when I get put down. I've put down enough in my life. I don't like being put down. Well, there's some things that I can put down about you that are true. I don't know, like the size I'm of my dick. I'm just things out about yourself. Your dick is one. You, you've got 12 inch cock and mine is not 12 inch. Your fat ass, your big belly, your bald ass head. Well, I'm not fat, so I know I don't need to worry about that. No, you are. You're definitely fat. I don't see those abs. I You're see bald, ab. yep. Huh? I see one ab. You're supposed to have multiple abs. I should be able to see your muscles, but I can't. I have never had six abs. Ever. They're under in there. They're covered with your it, fat. No. Look, look yeah. at people. Well, when I was 19, and I, I grew up working in the woods, and I swept my fucking ass off. So? Everyone has abs under there. Everyone has muscle structure. Yeah. Everybody you just that can't does see it eat. because of your big, flappy belly. Everybody that does not eat. I use up energy when I fucking work. And I get not fucking enough. hungry. I'm going to fucking eat. Not enough. I am going to fucking eat. Burn it up. Even I am longer. If I'm You're fucking hungry, fat. I'm going to eat. I don't give a fuck. I'm you obviously should. not that fat. You are, though. I'm telling you. You would never no. make it out here in show business. That's probably why they never signed I'm, you in Nashville. I am not trying to make it in show business. You want to be a singer? You can do karaoke for the rest of your life? I want to be a singer. It has nothing to do with the, what my stomach is. It has to do with what you look like. People aren't going to want some disgusting, weird-looking guy. Nobody wants I'm to I'm a good-looking guy, and I already know that. It doesn't matter if I have my belly sticks out a little bit. Which my belly doesn't even stick out. <laughs> what, you want to give people so, more things to laugh about? Um, I did. People are going to find their own shit to fucking laugh listen, about. Listen, listen. You're not going to make it. I'm telling you that. That's what cheer me on. Good way to the world. You're like 50 Good years old. Young. You're a karaoke singer. That's not a country singer where somebody's going to be like... Oh, I want to, I want to sign you. It's never happened. It didn't happen back when you were in Nashville. Didn't even happen. You don't think you don't think that my voice is good enough to make it into country music? No, no, I don't. Wow. Well, it's not. I'm being honest there's with you. Very, there's been very, very few people that have said that to me. Well, they're not being honest. Really? This was before yeah. the thing. Yeah. They all lied. You know, a lot of times, it's kind of like, you know, when a little kid draws a picture, and you're like, oh, that's so beautiful. And you have no idea even what it is, but 
you just want them to feel good about themselves. You're not going to tell them that they draw like shit. They can't stay in the fucking lines. You're just going to go along with it. She'd be like, okay, I'm going to make somebody feel good. But there needs to be people in everyone's life to bring them back down to, you know, to earth a little bit. Just be like, you know what? I'm really not going to be a country singer. I'm not going to be signed to a major label. I'm not going to go on tour. That's why those things happen like one in a million. You get some extra special people who have extra special talent and it just happens to work out. And then everyone else just kind of goes about their lives. Do you know how many people and their kids? Wait, do you know how many people when their kids say, I'm going to be a ballerina, I'm going to be a football star. And it just, it doesn't happen because they're just not cut out for it. So whenever I walk into a karaoke, a karaoke bar and I start singing and everybody just stops and listens, doesn't yeah. mean anything. Well, yeah, you're at a karaoke bar. That's what people are there to do. It doesn't, no, it doesn't mean anything. You don't know what they're thinking about um, when they're stopping and staring at you. They could be like, okay, this guy comes in here and sings the same songs. Here he is again, taking his 20th turn. Is so, this really the way you're going to stand beside me? I'm not going to be unrealistic. Okay, I'm not going to be unrealistic. I'm telling you to, like, get back to earth. Go get yourself a job. Concentrate on that. And don't have this, like, hokey-ass dream. That's never going to happen. You're almost dead. What do you have, like, 20, 30 years left? Come on, Are you seriously (laughs) fucking saying this shit to me? What the fuck is wrong with you? I'm trying to get you to be real. You can have singing as a hobby. Listen, you can have singing as a hobby. That's perfectly fine. Wow. But to have this as like you're going to break out and be signed and have a tour and, you know, be the next great country music star, it's just not going to happen. This is really how you're going to stand beside me by fucking putting me down. I'm telling you the truth. You can't be a country singer and smoke three fucking packs a day. You don't even know what it's like to be a professional singer. You don't even know. Get your fucking ass here and... And what, tell all this to you, to your face? Where, where, where there's nothing on California either. There's nothing on California that you can't do here. Everything on California around, you can do here. When did here. this turn around the to me working? Now. When did this turn, ar- turn around to me working? I'm talking about you singing. Yeah, yeah well, you're working and on there, but a you hobby. do the same thing here. Yeah, but you're talking about me coming there, and I'm talking to you about your singing, and how it's a great you hobby, and I'm smoking? glad that you love it. You want me to start smoking? <laughs> I want you me. to be realistic. I want you to be realistic with this dream that you have. I am you're fucking be a country realistic. Star. Right, so say it. I'm not a country music star. I'm not going to be one. I'm not going to say I'm not going to be one. You should. <laughs> Just because you don't like my singing doesn't mean that other people don't. You I have no stability in your stop. life. You don't even have a job. Fucking singing sucks. I'm saying you're not a country music star. That you're going to be found out and then you're going to be signed to this label. You're going to have all these CDs and all these fans and you're going to go out on tour. Come on. You're saying that my thing is sucks. I'm saying it's the same. You're saying that you're wanting to be a country music star is the same thing as me saying I want to play center field for the Red Sox. It's just, it's unrealistic. It's just not. Do you like my singing? Do you like my singing? It's okay. It's karaoke singing. It's okay. Yeah. <laughs> if you were so great, they would have found you in Nashville, but they didn't. In a month? You're just like, you're just like all the they other singers. They would have found me in a month. You're like all the other you, singers. You, you, know, you know what's funny about being, me being in Nashville and singing is that when I went to Buck, uh, Buckwall Saloon, right across the road from fucking Wild Oats Saloon, there's mm-hmm. speakers outside. When I, when right. I sang, people would stop and look in the window and listen to me sing. Because they had so, speakers outside the window, so people yeah. could hear them. So what? People could hear the people that were singing. Yeah, they were when listening I was singing, to people. people would stop and listen. You think when I started the singing, one? When I started singing, everybody in the bar would stop and listen. Who cares? You're singing at a karaoke bar. Maybe you were singing a song that they liked. A producer gave me his car. <laughs> a producer. Oh, okay, that's now like, you don't believe me. That's like a photographer handing out a card and be like, hey, 
here's a card. Take some pictures of you. They're like a dime a dozen. People with my voices are not a dime a dozen. There's only one of me. Yeah, I know there's one of you. But you're not a star. You're a karaoke singer. I have something to give to the fucking world. And it certainly wasn't fucking to catch a predator. That's what it ended up being. And maybe that was meant to be. That's how the world got to know you. That's how the world got to see the goofy fucking shit that you were up to. Maybe country music wasn't my thing at the time. Be- it still isn't, though. And if I stop smoking? It's still not going to be. Gonna be? No. That's because you... One reason of that is because I don't sing to you like I, like I should sing to you because I don't want to yell in your ear. You don't have to yell in order to sing well. No, but it's, when I, when I sing, I get into be. what I'm singing. It's just not meant to be. It's fine that you have this hobby. And when you get com- your computer back, put out your videos of you singing. Do that. But that's it. That's all that it's going to be. And what if it turns out to be more? It's not going to be. Stop hanging your head on that. Like, this is going to happen. I'm waiting for my big break. <clears throat> How do you know it's not going to be? Well, I can't predict the future, Lauren, but I can be real about it. <laughs> There's nothing special. There's no spark. <laughs> you don't yeah. Hang on. <laughs> you don't think there's anything special about me saying? No. Then what do you see in my saying? That you like to do you like to do it because you like to do it. So it's not it's not that you like my voice? <laughs> It's, your voice is okay, but it's not. I wouldn't buy it. So any any anybody's voice would do. I'm saying I'm telling you. I'm not talking about other people's voices. I'm talking about you. I wouldn't buy your singing because, like I said, it's something you would hear in a karaoke bar. Anybody can get up to an open mic. But you also don't. Really, you also don't like country music. No, I don't like country music. It doesn't matter. You haven't sang all country songs. You sang Brian Adams. I guess I really got to fucking stop smoking. It must, it must have affected my voice. It's not Brian smoking. Adams. It's not smoking. Lauren, you're not going to be a country music star. Get real and put out your videos if you want to, but just understand that that's as far as it's going to go. You're not going to get signed to this big label. They're not going to call you back to Nashville. You're not going on tour with Tim McGraw. With Tim McGraw? However. I, I, don't, even think, I don't even think fucking Tim McGraw is that good. He's a shit. Who fucking cares? But you know what? He has he has a career, doesn't he? There's something yeah, special about him. Yeah, he has a career. Him. Yeah, he has a career. He has a, you know, the only reason he's got so much notoriety is because of Faith Hill. She's the one that's fucking good. Okay, so she's good. But they both have careers. I, I think a woman's fucking voice singing is so much better than a guy's anyway. Okay, but I'm okay. So then you're saying that women's voices are better than yours? Yeah, a woman that can fucking sing. I, I fucking I. It's like fucking Patty Loveless. She just fucking. Okay, I don't know who that is. It I, doesn't matter. Emma can sing. No. I've heard her. No, sing. like fucking she Patty Loveless or Faith Hill. Well, Shania Twain. Yeah, but yeah, but you're not like them either. Oh, Lee and Rhymes. That's another you're one. Not even, I know you know who Lee and Rhymes level. is. Of course I do. But you're not even on that level. They have something special no. about them. They have the look. Yes. They have the talent. Lee and Rhymes does not have the look. Listen. Lee and Rhymes is not that pretty. Neither do you. She's got the voice. She, she, do she, you. Her fucking voice is awesome. And you don't have the voice and you don't have the look. You're I not know, I'm star ugly. quality. You're not star quality, Lauren. I'm I'm ugly. Like what the fuck, man? <laughs> I'm not. Uh, I'm, I know I'm not as good looking as as oh, what's his name, uh, James Fowler. <laughs> I'm trying to make this a little bit funny because I'm tired of being serious. <laughs> well, I'm trying to just let you know in real, and you're gonna laugh. You're gonna say. I'm still going to make it someday. You'll see. I, uh, I have to laugh because when I think about James Foley, he's, just, he's so fucking ugly, it's unbelievable. <laughs> okay. <sighs> I'm, I'm taking everything that you say very seriously because I'm, it makes me mad. 
Well, don't get mad. Like we're just, smoking. It's not about smoking. I'm not mad at you. I'm not. I'm, I'm not mad at you. I'm, I'm mad because I didn't impress you. Uh, so I'm mad at myself. And then I uh, blame it all on the smoking. That's not the so smoking. So I need to quit smoking. It's the smoking. I know it's the fucking smoking. Because I know what ranges I can hit. I know what notes I can hit. You're I know how I can move my voice. You're not a professional. I'm not a professional writer. No, you're not a professional when singer. Singing, when, you know, when it comes to singing, I can hit the fucking same notes. All of it. Including no. How many times? How many times have you said I can't hit that note? I can't hit that note. But it's all because of smoking. I can't hit the fucking note because of smoking because I don't have the air and it affects my lungs. You're not a professional singer. I don't know how many times I have to tell you that, but I will. I'll keep telling you. Well, I was incarcerated. Wasn't smoking. Yeah. And I joined the band that was in there. Okay. And the guy <laughs> made me sing. The guy made me how we run that one. I can't remember the name of it. Joining a prison band is like joining, you know, yeah, something guy, at the school. Guy, like anybody. I encouraged me to hit the fucking notes that I that I didn't even know that I could hit, and I hit the fucking notes, the same notes of fucking Steve Perry hit. Yeah, but played, you're not Steve Perry. The, whole band, the band played the fucking same notes the same way the Journey played them. I bet you they didn't, because they're not Journey. Yeah, they did. Well, you don't even know what you're talking about. Okay, well, well, encourage me to quit smoking. It's not about smoking. I want to encourage you to be realistic. I'm being realistic. That's kind of, again, I bring it back to the whole baseball thing. If I was to say, you know what? If I just go out there and I work on my throw and I have a better throw, I'm going to have a chance. No, you listen. I'm going to have a chance at the Red Sox. Wouldn't you say, come on. You're really, you're not going to be a professional baseball player. That's ridiculous. Listen, I'm going to marry you, and you are not going to be fucking poor. <laughs> I am going to fucking make it in music one way you're or another. You're not. You're not. And I'm, you're not. You're not going to make it. You're not going to make Emma it. Do call Emma and ask her? Do call Emma no, and I'm ask not, her? I'm not bothering Emma. There's a whole lot of people that will have a whole lot of different opinions on them. <laughs> you're not a professional singer. What the fuck? What the fuck? I'm not a professional because of the fact that I'm not getting paid for it. Yeah. No, no, you're not even professional quality. You're not even a wedding singer. Okay, so, but if I wrote a pop song and sang that... It would still suck. It would suck a big dick. Really? Yeah. Okay. So now I get a challenge. Okay. All now right. I get a challenge to impress you on a pop song. Okay, well, here's this. Okay, you know that song, Making Love Out of Nothing at All? I'm going to call Emma, okay? Wait a minute, I want you to answer, answer this question. I want you to answer this question. That song, Making Love Out of Nothing at All by Air Supply. Mm-hmm. Do you know that song? Of course. Okay, so if I sang that song and I impressed you, would you think differently? No. No? What song is it going to take? Okay, sing it right now then. Sing it right now. Sing it your best. Sing it sing your it, very best. Sing it right now. Gee, you really pick a great time to do this. Oh, okay. Well, I mean, a professional would be able to just do it. Oh, yeah. Well, I'm, I'm, uh, I'll do my best right now. I'm going to tell you, I'm telling you ahead of time. You know, you know I, heard, I heard Lady Gaga <laughs> no, on, a, on the radio. I heard her. She was doing an interview. It was 6 o'clock in the morning. And she came in, Ooh. Lady Gaga. And she came in and she sang beautifully. Absolutely. She didn't say, she didn't come in and say, it's, it, I can't hit the notes. She just well, came in. Yeah, because she doesn't smoke. Yeah, she does, actually. Uh, she doesn't she smoke like I've smoked. You don't know that. Do you know that. her? <laughs> I, I, yeah, I, I can guarantee that. God, whatever. In order, in order for her to know, she cannot smoke. And, uh, she cannot smoke very much. Oh I know. My God. You're that. delusional. Okay, you want me, uh, you want me to make love out of nothing at all? Just fucking sing whatever. Don't yell at me, I'm sensitive. <laughs> okay, go. I know just how to whisper, and I know just how to cry. I know just when to face the truth, and then I know just when to lie. I can't do it right now. 
I'm too fucking self-conscious. <laughs> Boo, you're being booed off the stage. Oh.